After the event, something happened. It's a much sadder ending than you think. Uh, can we talk for a sec? Sure. I'm kind of tired of this sibling banter anyway. And so, we finally sat down and talked about it. There's the man of the hour. Hi. Hi. With one question, I found out everything. No, I've been hiding a lot of things lately, and I think it's about time I come clean about it. It's been affecting you, clearly. So, what, what, what exactly is the reason you came to Althea? For a while now, I've been having, like, I guess I would call them incidents. Incidents. Just losing control. Of your powers? Yeah. Okay, so it appears we have the same exact issue, then. Is that why you ran away from home, too? Yeah, how bad was it for you? I killed multiple people. The ones I knew, once as my friends. What was my dark secret that has finally been revealed? And that's why I ran. I didn't want to hurt you. I didn't want to hurt father or anyone. So I ran. As far as I could. And... I found Althea, and I thought maybe this place could help me control my powers. Has it? So far, I haven't even brought it up, honestly. I've been scared to even tackle magic as of lately, but I'm thinking that I should definitely bring it up sooner or later or else someone's gonna get hurt again. I feel bad for comparing you to mom now. It's, it's fine. Honestly, mate, I might as well be here. I mean, it look like her, exactly. He left for... At least he left for a good, a good reason. I didn't want to harm you, that's why. There's other reasons why I wanted you to go as well. It was not just me. I've been told by people not to, like, say it or bring it up. Because, um, if other students find out, this could... Let's just say, um, panic. Is there anything to do with the ball? Who said that to you? I talked to Lobster about the whole thing after we had that argument. Oh. And when I, I kind of mentioned that you said external things, and they said that there was, like, mud falling out of the sky at the ball or something. It was much more than that, Matthew. It's basically, we all got ambushed by uh, these things called Acolytes, and the leader of them, Malivore, which apparently he is some sort of magic user who wields mud. And um, we had to escape from a ball. I helped everyone escape by uh, placing a block to get out of the ball, because uh, there's a bunch of fences around. And um, yeah, we, we all had to run, because it got invaded by Malivore and his gang. And, I'm afraid to tell, like, the school about this because, um, well, you see, a student died there. How do people not know that it happened? Wouldn't everyone who attended the ball at least know? Well, yeah, but besides that, nobody else is aware of this. Sounds like this guy is dangerous, and that's why I kind of thought that... I would push you to leave. And, yeah. That's all I can say, really. Do you know anything about... Do you know any more about it, or... Well, I do... Like, details do... about the whole... I do know that, um... I won't say names, but... An Alivore is after a specific member. And there's a possibility that Elphea could get raided. But Leah did tell me that there's a magical barrier around Elphea. But who knows if that can hold up against such a powerful magic user like Malivore. So... You, you still want me to leave? It's up to you now. I'm gonna leave that choice to you if you want to stay or go. I left Matthew with that choice. If you desire, you can become one.